The only sport my husband and I do together, I don't know if there's couples that do sports together, um, it's not a good idea. <laughs> we kayak, and we own a tandem kayak. That's the one with the two seats. And if you've ever seen a couple in a tandem kayak and thought, hmm, wonder what's going on there. Let me tell you, one person in that boat really likes kayaking. <laughs> yeah. The other person wanted to buy a Vespa. Uh, <laughs> so he really wanted to get this kayak. I was like, fine, we'll get the kayak. And then I'm like, well, what are we gonna do? Like, just kayak around English Bay? And he's like, no, we're gonna go on a kayak camping trip. And I was like, that's two separate things. <laughs> camping is on land. And he's like, we put our stuff on the kayak and kayak. And I was like, I don't wanna be with you anymore. Uh, <laughs> So we did it, like an idiot, I do this. We put all our stuff in the boat. We kayak to one of the Gulf Islands. Now, first, I've never kayaked before, ever. First day, six hours in the boat. Six, I know, I was so mad. Six, I was furious. He's in the seat behind me. Hour three, I, and the problem is, you, go, you wanna go with the wind at your back, right? So he's coaching me nonstop for six hours. <laughs> I am yelling things back of a less coaching manner. Um, <laughs> and he's just uh, nonstop. You ever learn a new thing with your partner? Just so many tips. <laughs> We're paddling, he's like, use your core. I'm like, oh, I hate you. <laughs> and then he's like, keep up with my stroke. And I'm like, I can't do it in the bedroom, I'm not doing it here. <laughs> Just, right? So we camp for like four days and it's the best. Um, best time of my life, I'm on the ground. I know there's a journey back. And so we have to kayak back. And now we get in the kayak late. It's not important whose fault it was, but it wasn't mine. And <laughs> The sun is going down, and I'm panicking, because you don't want to be on the water when the sun's going. So we got headlamps on, and like, I'm like, I'm really nervous right now, and that's when I had my sea biscuit moment. Like, Jay stepped up, and he was like the coach from Rocky, right? Like, he was like behind me, and he's like, do you see that light in the distance? And I was like, uh-huh. And he said, that is the last pub open <laughs> on Cortez Island, and it closes in 45. My core was going. <laughs> I was kicking up fish. I was like, my weapons! Uh, you guys have been great, Renapeg. Thank you very much.